Okay, so here we are looking at two machines. The first machine on my left, or hopefully on your left too, is an all cast aluminum frame. It is a Bernina 330 frame, and this is a, a sit, sitting side by side with a big box machine to the right. And the big box machine doesn't have a frame. It basically sits in the molded plastic of the, the cover of the machine. There is nothing for the machine solidly to be sitting on. So I'm gonna come over here and we're gonna look a little bit closer at this. And if you notice, what you're gonna see is as you look around on this machine, there is nothing between say right here and here, except for this little metal bar. There is, you know, we're gonna come down here. And if you look between here and here, those, there is nothing there either. There's nothing solidly holding on to this. This is a little piece of metal right here. There is one piece of metal here. I, 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 shocking. It's actually got between the motor and the frame, it's got this little piece of metal. That's it. Then if you come down here between this part and this part, and that is where your feed dogs, and there's another motor in here to hang and controlling those, there's one little piece of metal. What you're seeing right here, this is all plastic. That's just the cover of the machine. So here's the, where the feed dogs and the bobbin are all gonna sit. And there's this one little area of metal right here too, and that is screwed into a piece of plastic. So when this machine is sewing up and down, and anybody who's seen a sewing machine and knows how they go, and they vibrate a tremendous amount, think about if the only thing holding all these pieces and parts is basically this little plastic frame. That's it. That's the only thing we've got that is supporting all these metal parts and this thing going up and down right here. That's it. That's, that's it. So we've got a few metal pieces. I'm not saying that they don't have any metal in them, but they don't have a support frame. And it's all plastic. Um, the area where the computer's sitting on is all plastic, which makes sense, actually. Most of them do have that set up. But look at this. This is a solid aluminum cast frame. It's made up of two parts. The top here is one part and the bottom's another part. And I don't know that much about casting metal, but I can tell you that this is actually really heavy and I can tell you this is not I can lift up that little machine it's super easy to go ahead and open lifting that up nothing to it so you want to know why your Bernina costs a bit more there's a huge difference and if you want a machine that's going to last you a while is going to actually do work on all the kinds of different things you want to sew this is the reason why. Nothing for those parts to sit on except for plastic, where all the parts are connected to metal in the case of Bernina. And so hopefully one of these days I'll get a picture of an inside of a brunette for you, but I can guarantee you it's a lot better than this. And the other thing that I want to point out is both the Burnettes and the Berninas have warranties, and you're not going to get that with your big box store machine. The only thing you can do with those is if something goes wrong in the first year, you can probably return them. But they are building these as throwaway machines. If you believe in sustainability, you wanna pass this machine on to your kids or your grandkids, you can't do it with one of these types of machines. They are basically a throwaway and you won't be able to do so here they are, the big box special and the Bernina. Now, it's really funny 
But the other thing that I probably should mention is our technician thinks that these big box sewing machines oftentimes are not coming in with any kind of lubrication in them too. Well, I also wonder if maybe just, and they don't get sold for a while, they're manufactured in Asia, and then they come over to the US on a big container ship and maybe it dries up and it's just not there anymore. Um, but there's not really, you know, they say right on the front of the box, self-oiling machine. Um, well, actually not so much, um, at least from what we're seeing. Um, there is some black residue inside of this of where things are starting to actually crumble and come apart. And this machine isn't even three years old. Um, this machine is just so much better made. Um, referring to my Bernina, it is so much better made. And the price points are pretty different. Um, I understand that. And I understand that some people can't maybe think they can't afford a better sewing machine. But can you afford to go ahead and replace this machine five times? I had a customer who came in here and he saved up his money and he bought his wife a new Bernina. A, actually, it was a Bernina 335. He bought her a 335. And the reason he bought her a 335 was because they had gone through five of these in 10 years. They just kept on breaking on them. And there's not really anything you can do when they break. You can return it to the store if you're within a year, but after a year, they don't even, they won't help you. And if something happens to your Bernina, guess what you can do? You can come in and see us. We will help you. We will figure it out. We'll get you either a new machine if it's really that bad. We've done that, I think, twice since I've been in business. And it wasn't so much because the machine was unfixable. It was because the person was anxious to have a machine back in their possession. So we went ahead and fixed it. And we went ahead and gave them a different machine. Um, but they've always been fixable. We've always been able to get something done with our machines and get them back up and running and ready to go again. And I can't, I mean, I've called 10 people in the last year and told them that their big box machine is given up the ghost and is not re worth fixing. Um, so what I guess the idea here is, is that you can save up your money and maybe put this on layaway, or you can buy this five times. You're going to support an actual person and not a big box store when you go and purchase something like this. And you're going to get something that you could potentially pass down to a child or to your grandchild. Um, that makes this a much more special piece of equipment. So... Don't forget, we offer the Bernina credit card and you can use that. And that is a lot of times 0% interest that you can just pay over a period of time. Um, there's some of them where you get, if you get a little bit higher end machine that is at 4%, but you can't do that with your credit card. And we can sign you up for that very quickly and get you all taken care of. Now. We have right now, and we get from time to time, demo machines also. And the demo machines are ones that have been used at Bernina to teach classes, and they've gone ahead and they've uh, gone ahead to take and do, um, they, they have their service technicians take the machine after they've had some classes with them, and then they make sure everything's perfect with them. They send them to various dealers across the U.S., and we can sell them to you at a discount. But the really cool part about it is they come with full warranty. It's like buying a new machine, but a better price point. So we've got some of those right now of 480s. I'm keeping my eye out to see when the next time they'll have some 335s. And when they do, I'll buy them. Um, but we always try to look for deals for you. 
and we try to make sure that we give you a fair price when you come in and you purchase from us. So we'd love to see you. If you wanna talk more about machines, we have people here who love to talk about machines. <laughs> We're very silly. We love our sewing machines. We love our Berninas and we think they're very special. And I feel really good about selling this sewing machine. I personally do not think there's any sewing machine that competes with it as far as engineering and the frame goes. I don't think anything else on the market's quite like it. And I think that you will be very happy with it. If you give me a chance to show it to you and demonstrate it for you, guess what we can do? We can do it on Zoom. We don't have to do it in person. You can tell me what you wanna see, how to do on this machine and I'll show you how it works. So if you think that you might be ready to move up to the best machine you'll ever own, let me know because I'd love to sell you a Bernina. I think they're wonderful and I think you will too. You have a wonderful day today and I hope we will see you soon.